Yep, that's the mask you get for collecting all the masks and trading them away. The Fierce Deity's Mask. Let's equip the light arrows too. And maybe just for fun, Great Fairy Sword. Alright. Alright, now, here's some debate. Should I really use the Fierce Deity's Mask here? Or should I beat the game fair and square? You know what? After all I've been through, and all the trouble I went to get this mask, might as well show it off. And if you follow this walkthrough, why wouldn't you use this mask on the final boss anyway? Tips the balance in your favor a lot, but... You know. It's worth it. This mask only works in boss rooms, by the way. Well, Majora's Mask. When you swing your sword, you launch these discs things at it. And then after a certain amount of hits, <laughs> he summons his minions. It's kind of overpowered. It's taken him down already. So if you actually recognize these sprites, which you really should, they're the Ocarina of Time sprites for Holder Link. Each of these discs take up, uh, magic, so... So remember, if you don't have Chateau Romani, it's gonna take up magic. And now it's time for phase two of the boss battle. Come on, let me target the remains. Easy as that, huh? Uh oh, phase three. I'm just gonna spam, spam for the win. And there you go, I beat the game. Or did I? Maybe there's a phase four to the fight. Nope, the game's really over. Dawn of a new day.
Maybe. Maybe not. And they still don't. Okay. Maybe not. I think we've already met before. What a coincidence. As long as it doesn't involve anything stupid. Yeah, the evil's gone. But you don't know for that for sure. So you're going to take it home and put it in your collection box. Because you're so stupid. Okay. I guess so. And this guy couldn't afford an exit, so he just disappeared. <laughs> 